417, let's get you updated on the forecast. Obviously a huge sports day for Indianapolis, oh, yeah. and that includes finally getting some real good time on the track, right? A lot right? of dry time here. Yeah. We've tweaked the forecast a little bit for tomorrow. Okay. I don't think it's going to be completely dry, but a little more optimistic that we're oh, going to have windows to work with on Fast Friday. So that is certainly a bit of good news, too. And yes, let's get you ready for the evening. And then qualifying weekend. So much going on in our city here. Uh, mid 70s right now. There's a lot of cloud cover around. There's not a whole lot of rain. We've been following this uh, approaching weather system and we've been seeing the rain weakening on live Doppler 13 radar, something we expected now. But you can see out and around, uh, there's been some little bubble ups of uh, spotty downpours, rumbles of thunder. We've seen a few of that. Uh, up across the northwestern section of the state and it's been a really nice day far east where you're almost at 80 degrees here. So um, we're going to get some of this action. It's going to be relatively light if it does indeed hold together. Now as we go through the overnight, the atmosphere is going to begin to saturate and we're going to have a little bit more in terms of rainfall and I think we're going to start a little damp tomorrow morning. That includes some drizzle. It also includes uh, areas of fog in addition to the rain that will be coming with this weather feature. So here's future track 13 tomorrow morning. There's the cloud cover. Now maybe the greater concentration of rain and downpours is going to be over the southern third of the state, but there will still be pop ups that we're going to have to work around as we go into fast Friday here. So speaking of if you're going to the track tomorrow, there will be some fog around some midday peaks of sunshine and then scattered showers and rumbles of thunder anywhere from a 50 to 70% chance going to the field house tomorrow night for game six. We are expecting again some of those hit and miss showers and thunderstorms for qualifying weekend. No significant forecast changes. A lot of dry time on Saturday, but there will be some pop ups as well. Sunday it's 83 in sunshine hottest air of the year. We're still targeting that for Monday and Tuesday of next week before another weather player shows up uh, on Wednesday. So we'll see, see you with another radar check coming up here at 430.